Fences Bridge is a unique little community with a great sense of community in it. I call it a little slice of heaven on earth. We have this fabulous climate, beautiful scenery, lots of wildlife. There's stuff to do, fishing and rafting. We have some very famous whitewater rafting here. Of course, we got the world famous steelhead fishing. The Murray Creek Falls, if you want natural wonders, go stand underneath the falls on a hot summer day like today. We got all these little hidden gems in Spence's Bridge. We got the oldest operating inn over here across the river, the log cabin pub over here, and if you ever stepped in there, it's like a veritable museum. In the packing house is a great little spot for uh, get-togethers. This was our uh, little idea of incorporating the music, and that's sort of how the festival got started. We pick the things in the morning, they go in, your peaches go in your pie that day, and your vegetables and your salads and soups, and you're gonna have the sweetest melons in the world and the best tasting tomatoes. We're in a desert, but you throw water on it and it grows. So the tomatoes, people drive for miles around for Spence's Bridge tomatoes. Just They're coming that far to get our produce. That's how popular it is. It's that good, it really is. And my idea was always to incorporate the farm experience with the festival because we have this incredible produce. There's so many of us that just love music and really want to support Canadian struggling musicians and have more people experience that. Just showcase what this area has to offer. We've got tons of vendors with huge variety of different foods and crafts and jewelry. We really just want people to come and enjoy music and enjoy the area. It's a family, you know, it, it, it's different. You know, even our festival has that intimacy of smallness and the intimacy there means. We have a small volunteer base, but they're really dedicated so the activities that go on here are phenomenal and that's one of the things that made us decide to move here and stay and I've been here for 20 years. But that's what it's all about. You're always getting together as a family and that's I think the beauty of small rural communities like Spences Bridge. I would welcome anyone to come and visit Spences Bridge because we are unique, we're friendly, it's just a great spot to come.